The year is 2009, eight years before Zhu Zhaodong will have the first in his series of matches. Although China has a burgeoning Sanders scene that has turned out some successful competitors to this point, they still have a way to go before becoming the ascending combat sports powerhouse that they are now. Meanwhile polluting the narrative in the Asian martial arts scene are several cultish masters with pretensions of supernatural powers. Anawa fighting out the Gi Samrat Jim as multiple time major stadium champion and fighter of the year in Thailand. He fought as a pressure fighter and one of the most determined fighters in Thailand. He would close the distance using hard blocks. Once inside range he would have no problem trading strikes in order to land a big strike of his own. He is in short the worst candidate to encounter for anyone with delusions about the highly physical and uncomfortable nature of competition in a combat sport. The bouts of the 2009 Asian Martial Arts Games will be contested under amateur Sandra rules. Kicks and punches will be legal to all available conventional targets. Knees and elbows will be illegal and a lot of wrestling and judo games will be legal that Anawat will not be familiar with. In Anawat's first match, after an exchange of a couple of leg kicks, his opponent in black does a shrewd move in going for a takedown. However, it's not a fantastic attempt and Anawat is able to shrug it off. After a couple more leg kicks, he crumbles. He tries to stand, but the damage is done, and it's a TKO. In Anawat's second match, he makes short work of his opponent, landing a right hand that knocks him out cold. In his third match, Anawat in the black outfit will follow with more of the same, knocking out his opponent with a left hook. In his fourth match, Anawat this time in the red outfit will face Kim jong Yul, a wrestler from Korea who will repeatedly take him down on route to a points victory. This will leave Anawat with second place in the tournament overall.